my youtube channel and today we are going to uh, talk about the Fexels API Fexels the Fexels is a website which uh, which is a, an image library and we will be using the Fexels API uh, which will be uh, for image downloading and image printing we will be getting the images from the pixels website from the pixel website programmatically if I show you the pixel website it is a website uh, which we can call an image library here are uh, thousands of images millions of images uh, which can be free and fed if you buy the premium subscription you so you can uh, get the copyrights of images now uh, if we have a web app or an android app and we want to download images or show image as a background through uh, using the pixels api so today i am going to get the pixel api and will teach you about how can you get the pixels api from uh, pixels website so here i will show you how to get the pixels api from a pixels website I have create I have uh, opened the website in my another window if you come here and write pixels API pixels API key so you will get the first link of this website which is free images and value API you can download and get the value too from this website so I have uh, registered my account here you can see I'm logging I'm a login user in the Fexels. If I show you my profile, I have verified my profile. Uh, there is no need for verification. I have just verified my account with an email uh, OTP. So you can create a simple profile here. And if you come here to this uh, web page, this URL, you will get a button your API key. So here is my API key. You can see it here. And this is the uh, documentation. You can read the documentation which will uh, show you exactly how can you utilize this api to get the images and values also uh, there are uh, red limits for um, uh, basic users uh, i'm telling you about uh, red limitation for um, pre-users this is a free api so if you purchase the api premium uh, api from this website so you will get uh, a higher uh, api hits api red limit, uh, limitations so uh, let's come to the code editor and i will be teaching you about how can you utilize this api to get the images uh, links pro programmatically so i am uh, closing this let's close this and i will open the code editor I am creating a new file here uh, pixels.fi and now we will be writing the code for the pixels API to find the images or get the images uh, programmatically from the pixels website so I will be importing the uh, request library I have installed the request library you can install it here I think I have not installed it here like you can install it pip install requests so uh, the API is already installed I think import requests no I'm going to delete this file I will be writing my code in the main.fio file you can create any file here to write the code but I am using main.fui I have created this file so I will be using the uh, request library for this this library is mainly used for sending a request to the API a website and uh, I will be using this library in my whole tutorial today so I have imported the uh, request library you can install the request library like pip install request now I have to create a class uh, I will be writing code for a class to uh, print the images from the Fexels API utilizing the Fexels API so I am writing the code like uh, I am creating a class 
pixels API I will name this class pixels API and mm, I will be create a nested uh, init init function here which is the initialization of the class so this functions is taking some parameters like self and also it will be taking the api key which we will be giving as a parameter to test functions like uh, now we have to write like self dot api key which is api key now i have to write uh, self dot base url this is our base url for the api which we will be hitting so this is uh, https https and uh, api dot pixels dot com and we are using the basic api which is version one this is a free one now i have create uh, i have to create another function which is search image function you can name and you can name it any name like uh, i am writing for this uh, search images you can give any name to this function this is not required that you are my own uh, it will take a parameter self and the other parameter it will be taking a query query and now i have to write for fetch is equal to 10 so this api will be taking 10 images from uh, every page there are uh, paginations in the website if you uh, got my phone so that's all it uh, the header the headers will be uh, authorization this is the header when we are sending request so we must give the headers it is authorization and also it will be self dot api key we will be actually sending the api key in the header so that the pixels understand uh, get our api and confirm it the palms will be uh, query uh, per page and also the response will be request dot get request dot get self dot base url plus this is the format of searching the api so you have to write like this uh, which is uh, uh, which i am writing like this is the header this is the headers one mistake in the header spill and also i have to close this bracket so that i don't get any issue also there is one another parameter which is the form form is equal to forms now i have to write a condition f response the response which will be coming uh, the response dot status code is equal to 200 the 200 uh, status code is usually uh, an okay uh, which is a successful response from the site which we are heading through an api which is uh, uh, pixels website so the response will be uh, response dot json actually uh, the data will be returning in the json format so now i have to pay uh, scrape the image images url from the uh, json so this is two two src the src are usually the source uh, link up in image and also the original one and this is a for loop for photo which will be coming in request so i have to get the photo 
omit now else friend uh, pair to uh, pitch the images sorry and also I will be printing the status code response dot status code and this status code will be now coming from the pixel website is a uh, request is a response sorry it will be returning uh, an empty list because we are creating a uh, list comprehensions here now I have to write the main function which will be actually uh, running this file if uh, name is equal to main the API key the API key which I have copied from a website I have show I have showed it before to you so my a API was this one I have to make it like this in a string and make it a string now I have to write a code for the pixels uh, pixels API pixels API is equal to pixels the class I have created and now it will be uh, taking the API key is a parameter which is this one this API will be uh, giving is a parameter to this class in this class will be using the api key and the base url to hit this base url using this api key and it will uh, give us all the images in return to us and also the number of pages and all the things we are um, writing code for below so now i have to write some code like query is equal to input this is an input function for the python and i will be writing here like uh, enter your query and also num images at how much images we need in order to front so this is I will be enter. I will write here the uh, enter the number of images of images to point. Now I have to write another line of code like uh, images URLs is equal to pixels. Sorry, uh, pixels API pixels api i have written this a capital v so i am getting an error i have to copy this one pixels api dot uh, search image i have to get the search image function from this class which we have assigned to this pixels api variable now we are accessing this function the search image functions uh, from this variable which we have assigned to this function so we have to give a parameter to this function like query and num number of images now I have to I have to print uh, images URLs URLs for URL and images URL and print the URL now if I run this code what will be happening here I am going to run this code you can run the code uh, from this uh, run the Python code or you can run the code from this if you are using a uh, VS code which will store you code uh, editor so I am printing the code it asks for me enter the query 
which I have written here enter the query so my query will be uh, let's suppose uh, give the query like left off and now it asks for the enter the number of images to print so it will be actually uh, I have uh, I should have write like enter the number of images URL to friends so it will be uh, it will be actually uh, returning all the SRC source link of the images to print so I will be uh, giving the input like 5 uh, what is the error I am getting an error image pixels number of images is no attribute search image search image what could be the issue here let's try again uh, giving the query the query will be left off and the enter the number of images to print URL for uh, it will be five now panel to pitch the URL uh, 401 it is actually blocking us from the getting images one error uh, is unauthorized error which means that our API was uh, wrong maybe I have uh, make it wrong like uh, removing um, integer uh, string from this uh, whole string so this is now the correct API I have written the correct API let's try again let's clear this text and try again and run the code like I will give the query like uh, left off and the images will be 5 now if I have to enter the 5 which is returning a 5 URL of images now if you want to check these uh, URLs you can check it in uh, Google Chrome you can check it here if I enter this URL it will be showing uh, the laptop image now if you want to check this second you can see it you can see it like I'm copying this URL and will be teaching you this it is again in our laptop image let's open another tab and try actually I'm sending too many requests to this website so it is blocking me and slowing me down so this is again a laptop images of two people uh, that's all uh, that's all you can uh, and using the pixels API to friend the images of URL you can friend uh, as much images uh, you want to friend but in free API there are limitations you can't misuse the API and it will block you for some time or will you uh, slow down for some days maybe block your account if you are using a free API and exceeding the limit of the API uh, thank you all and you can uh, see the code I have written here thank you